Oh man. What's up guys and welcome to a brand new Let's Play adventure with Ratchet and Clank going commando. Why this one is so special is because not only has it been such a long time in the making, but it'll be my first time ever playing the game. It is going to be a full blind Let's Play and I cannot wait to play it because I love Ratchet and Clank. I live streamed and Let's Played the first one and I also have played through the future series on the channel, but now we're going back you know, back to the good old days with Ration and Clank 2, one I've never played, so I'm really excited to play it, so why don't we head in? Welcome back to Behind the Hero. Tonight's heroes are the duo who recently restored peace and order to our galaxy, Ratchet and Clank. So, gentlemen, tell us about your latest incredible adventures. Well, as you can imagine, we've been pretty busy. After Drek's defeat, there were parades, press conferences, fancy dress balls. And the wiener roast at Al's. Oh yeah, that. And then, things started to slow down a bit. After that, we... well... There was the grand opening at Groovy Lube. Right. I think that was last week. Six months ago. We're still pretty busy, but in a more, um, domestic sense. Yesterday, I flushed out my radiator core. I guess no one needs a hero right now. Oh? Meanwhile, in the distant Bogon Galaxy, no one needs a hero, right? Little bottom, I found our man. Oh, there we go. Seconds later, what's gonna happen? Oh man, <laughs> where'd they go? I get to the Bogon Galaxy. I am Abercrombie Fizzwidget, founder of the Megacorp Company in the Bogon Galaxy. Bogon? I'm sorry to incapacitate you, but our entire galaxy is in a very precocious situation. I must humbly request your sustenance on a mission of dire urgitude, a mission of superfluous peril, a mission of unequivocal imperitude. Did that make any sense? Nope. So, you need me to go on a dangerous mission in another galaxy. Indubitably! A few days ago, this top secret biological experiment was stolen from our testing laboratory by this duplicitous criminal mastermind. And I need you to get the experiment back. We'll do it. We will. Frank, I have precipitated your recalcitrance and have made special improvisations for you. We are prepared to give you a job as the head accountant for Megacorp. Plus a penthouse suite in lovely Megapolis. And our state of the art robotic masseuse. Deal. As for you, Ratchet, I'll need you on some purgatory shape. While in transit to the Pokemon Galaxy, you will undergo heavy training and conditioning, including martial arts, heavy weaponry, survival skills, stealth, lacrime, ballroom dance, and origami. Oh my, quite a resume. Two weeks later. We've used bipolar vector regurgitation to track the thief's location to a flying base in Sector 7. In film, tribulate the base and retrieve the experiment. Sir, ready for launch. I love how half of that guy's words sort of weren't real. <laughs> I'm loving this so far. Those characters are hilarious, new and old. Wow, I I'm liking this a lot. And if you did not know, this is obviously on the HD Collection version. We played Ratchet and Clank 1 last year in 2014 on the HD Collection. Ratchet reporting. I'm on final approach to coordinates 37 Alpha. Good luck. I'm counting on you. Affirmative. Beginning radio silence. Okay then, are we gonna start out with flying or are we just flying to the ship? Whoa, <laughs> wow, it looks really cool. Compared to like, I really, really liked Ratchet and Clank 1, but I did think it definitely had its downfalls. No thanks, I like it how it is. Okay then, oh my, I'm so excited to go with ratcheting. Alrighty then, it's telling us the basics. We should pretty much know this. Looks like we got the Lancer and the Gravity Bomb. We'll stick with the Lancer for now. I mean, it sort of thinks that it doesn't, I mean, they're new weapons, they're new names and everything, but it's, it's basically the combustor. Alrighty then, we know how to do all that, so I'm gonna make her sort of be quiet, but oh man, it feels so good to be playing Ratchet and Clank because it's been so long for me. I'm a big, big fan of Ratchet and Clank, and most of the PlayStation 2 platformers, Jack and Daxter, Ratchet and Clank, and Sly Cooper, are all some of my all-time favorite games, so it's it's just so good to have this back in my hands again. And it's really fun that it's blind. It's, it's just, to me, it's a new game, and that's really important. And ooh, you wanna fight, buddy? Not anymore. <laughs> So if you are excited to see more Ratchet & Clank, feel free to let me know in the comment section below, along with giving me some support by, you know, leaving a like. That would be really, really appreciated, and whoa, the windows are open. Shouldn't we be flying out right now? I guess not. Hmm, that's sort of weird. Uh-oh, I think there's some guy behind me. Oh, no, okay. 
I got some ammo, cool. We only have two weapons now. I can't wait to see what crazy weapons are in this one. Of course, I'm sure I've seen them in other Ratchet and Clank games, because like I've said, I've played the Future Series all the way through. We have a Let's Play of every single Future Series level, um, and our video, her game up. What am I even talking about? Actually, the uh, Ratchet & Clank Future, uh, why am I forgetting the name? But Tools of Destruction is actually one of my most popular Let's Plays, one of my most successful. So that's always cool. It's a big history here in the channel. Alrighty then. Where are we off to now? Oh, these guys are still around. Get out of here. I love this. It actually gives us sort of like the feeling we're on a moving ship with all the other, uh, the other planes going around with us. But maybe we can take out this guy from a distance? Yes, we can. Okay. <laughs> Cool, and I mean the first cutscene definitely showed that this game has the level of humor that other Ratchet and Clank games have, so that makes me excited. But I did want to know what's your favorite Ratchet and Clank game? I haven't played them all, so I can't really say yet. But I, from what I hear, everybody's favorite is usually Ratchet and Clank 3. All right, so we know sort of all about how to play. So hopefully she's not saying anything super important. I also did notice we don't have Clank with us. He's sort of getting a massage from the uh, robot lady. <laughs> So, continue point. Oh, oh, looks like we found it. Who? Oh, oh no! See, it's time to update my security forces. Whoa, whoa, no, hey, no, no, look, I'm just here to fix the transflexor coil. Nice try. Give my regards to Megacorp. Oh my, where's he Finish off to? Him. We just killed like, <laughs> nice one. <laughs> Let's all laugh at him. <laughs> we just killed like 20 of these guys. Are two of them really gonna take us out? I don't think so. <laughs> yep, and there's a few shots, we take them out. And I think this is actually the first Ratchet and Clank game to introduce the level up system. So I'm really excited to see how this works out because I mean, we've experienced it in other Ratchet and Clank games, but is the formula the same here is what I'm expecting to find out. Let's pick up some more ammo though. And of course, we gotta get as many bolts as we can possibly get. I'm not planning on it being 100%, but if you guys really enjoy the series and I really enjoy playing through it that much, I'll definitely give it a shot and whoa, we're on top of a moving plane right now, more like a moving airship. This thing is gigantic and hello mountaintops and all of you. <laughs> this is so cool. And I'm actually, I'm pretty low in health here, so I gotta be careful, it's like, are we going through here? We do have some health, so that'll be helpful. Thugs for less. If it ain't broke, we'll break it. Right, I'm in the market for some security. You bring the cash, we'll bring the thrash. Good, I need your best men to meet me at these coordinates. Thugs for less, when they're not good at thugging, they're good at rhyming. <laughs> okay then, uh, let's get all these bolts, and we definitely need this health over here. So who is that mystery man? I know all about nanotech. Maybe we should disable her, I don't know. I, I mean, sometimes it's nice hearing her voice, it's sort of nostalgic. I mean, I picked up the first Ratchet and Clank game, I had to be in like the fourth or fifth grade. I mean, my childhood game, the game of my childhood is Jack and Daxter though, but just that PS2 set of like platformers is all very, you know, nice in my heart. And yeah, it looks like we are leveling up there, you can see on the top left. Oh, I like how it has a gun right there. Oh, wait, let's pull it back. Ouch, rude. I was trying to show my viewers some cool little stuff there, but you just want to beat me up? That's just rude, you couldn't have asked. It's like, hey, sir, can I please punch you in the face? But no, but if we pull it up here and actually press, <laughs> it actually sort of has a first person thing to it here, which is actually pretty interesting. I don't think that's how it was in the first game. Like how the gun is there in the corner? Alrighty. Um, we do need to grab these boxes. Gotta get every single one of them. How many bolts do we have right now? 4,200, cool. Alrighty, then go through the door where it's gonna be on the other side. Ooh. <laughs> More bad guys. Alrighty. So I can't wait to see like what enemies, some crazy enemies that are in this game. You know, like when the variety of guns isn't the pinpoint of Ratchet and Clank, it can sometimes also be the variety of enemies. But I think we're about to get a nanotech upgrade if you see on the top there. But the HUD is sort of like weird though. Uh oh. Oh no! We're surrounded! Uh, run! <laughs> Get out of here! Oh! <laughs> nice catch! There we go, Ratchet's doing it like a pro! How embarrassing! Oh well. Back to work. Ratchet checking in, sir. Incredulous. I didn't expect to hear from you again. Uh, so soon. 
There was a slight problem. The thief escaped with the experiment, and I have no idea where he was headed. Not to worry. I just received an omission which may lubricate the matter. Do you have any maps for this quadrant of the galaxy? You bet, mister! We got galactic maps, 3D maps, foldouts, cutouts, maps to the stars, and their homes! Sorry about that. Ah, oh, I forgot my wallet. Could you, you know, take care of this? Perimeter defenses deactivated. <laughs> you forgot your change. I'm on my way. All right, then off we go. This is so cool so far. I'm really enjoying this. What planet are we going to? Planet Uzla. Awesome. So we got the first planet done, which is great, and seem to be on a landing here. Oh man, I, just, I love the Ratchet and Clank formula. It's so much fun. I know all about the maps, lady, but there we go. Here's our first planet done, and we're already at the second one. Good progress, if you ask me. But I'd like to thank you guys so much for watching, and I want to remind you once again, if you want to see more Ratchet and Clank going commando blind, then make sure to leave a like in the comment section. <laughs> That's not what you do. Leave a comment in the comment section below. Leave me your thoughts and your opinions on this episode, and give me a like and the like button. All that kind of cool stuff. Apparently, I can't talk straight, but thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.